Banks have vowed not to go back to the exorbitant interest rates they were charging before the introduction of the rate caps, which were removed yesterday. The pledge follows the passing of President Huru Kenyatta's memorandum seeking to repeal the rate caps. Kenya Bankers Association Chairman Joshua Oigar stated that the banks would price loans reasonably, not exceeding 2-3% to of what they are currently charging. A consignment of cocaine and heroin worth over 589 million shillings was today destroyed at the forensic lab at the DCI headquarters here in Nairobi. The destruction of the drugs was supervised by interior CS Fred Matiangi, Inspector General of Police Larry Mutiambai, DCI boss George Kinoti and High Court Judge Justice Luka Kimaru. Plans to impeach Kiambu Governor Fanand Waititu today gained momentum after civil society groups under the banner of Kua Kiambu presented over 200,000 signatures to the leader of majority in the Kiambu County Assembly, Gideon Gashara. The Okoa Kiambu movement, which comprises of several groups drawn from across Kiambu County, insists that the directive by a High Court barring Waititu from office has affected service delivery in the county.